Good morning, Titans, and welcome to West Happenings. I'm Shelby Rose Long. And I'm Lauren Clark, and here's what's up for this week. Attention, Titans. Forecasting has begun. Current sophomores will be visited by counselors to review the process. Take the time to read the information, talk to friends, and anyone else as you decide what classes to take next year. Remember to consider some new classes that could potentially be offered next year. Here are some brand new possibilities. AP Human Geography, Latinx Studies, Botany, Street Lit, Science Fiction, LGBTQ Stories. These classes will be offered if there are enough students who sign up to take these classes. This is also a good time to think about what electives could really stretch you and help you enjoy Wes even more. Here are some electives to consider. Hi, I'm Jacob. Are you looking to get involved at West? Well, you should join theater. The theater program here is so much fun and you get to do so many new things and meet so many cool people. We promise that you'll have so much fun and that you'll never miss a beat. Hi, I'm Finch. There are options for everyone here at West. If you're wanting to act, you can take acting one, two, or three. But if it's your first time in theater, we recommend starting at the beginning with acting one. If you're wanting to do behind the scenes stuff, or you're not a fan of being front and center on stage, you can take intro to technical theater, so later you can move on up to advanced technical theater. Hi, I'm Grace. If you're wanting to jump straight into performance classes, either in our musical or Shakespeare shows, um, these classes require auditions, but you can still forecast for them so you can save a space in your schedule for it. We really hope you decide to take theater classes next year because we're always so happy to welcome new people. Here's Katie and Kate with a video. What was your favorite class? Miss Hannah's English 12 class. Okay, okay. What was your favorite class this semester? My favorite class was chemistry. Why? Because it was easy and I had my friends. What's your favorite class this semester? Probably Marketing 3. We got to do a lot of social media posts and it was a lot of very informational. Ooh, okay, businessman, okay. And what was your favorite class this semester? Uh, definitely weight training. It's definitely good to be uh, physical and active. It's one of my favorite things to do. Exchange students looking for a host family. If you are interested in other cultures, want a friend for life, or wish to know how other people live, there's an opportunity for you to host an exchange student. If you are interested in hosting an exchange student, please contact Mrs. McGlade or scan this QR code. The annual A Thousand Souls Shoe Battle is on March 1st through the 17th, the competition between second period classes A and B wings versus C, D, E wings. Collection will be on March 21st. Here is Chloe with the question of the week. What is your name? Charlotte. What grade are you in? I'm a freshman. How many seagulls could show up in your house without you being suspicious that someone's putting there? Probably like 69. Uh, what's a pet peeve that you have? that no one else just can understand. <laughs> um, when people decide to ride my horse without my permission. Valid. What is your name? Maddie. What grade are you in? I'm a freshman. How many seagulls could show up in your house without you being suspicious that someone put them there? 18. Uh, what's a pet peeve you have that no one else can understand? When people say babies are cute, I think they're ugly because they all look the same. No, that's not valid. What is your name? Rebecca. What grade are you in? I'm a freshman. How many seagulls could show up in your house without you, un until you become suspicious that someone put them there? Probably about two. <laughs> What's a pet peeve you have that no one else can seem to understand? Um, I don't know. What is your name? Mateo. What grade are you in? Uh, junior. How many seagulls could show up in your house until you become suspicious that someone put them there? Um, two. What's a pet peeve you have that no one else can seem to just understand? Uh, feet on table. Valid. NHS and Spanish NHS will have their spring induction Wednesday, March 8th at the library at 7 p.m. Come support our new inductees. French National Honor Society will have their Mardi Gras dance Friday, March 10th. It is from 8 to 10 p.m. and it's $5 per person. Dancing, food, games, and door prizes included. All six West Robotics team qualify for state that will take place on March 11th in Klamath Falls. 
The Salem Dream Center nonprofit is a nonprofit on Edgewater in Salem, Oregon. Their mission is to transform our community one life at a time through relationships. Relationships are the key to reaching someone who has been hurt by the harsh effects of poverty. They build this relationship through education, mentorship, and food sufficiency. Look for them at lunches to learn about how you can join their great efforts. Parking at West, you know the drill. Juniors and older with parking permits only, unless you're a visitor. Students can park in the far and lower lots. Staff and vid visitors in the upper lots in front of school and by the stadium. Drop off lane is just that, drop off and pick up. Keep it moving. Max Credit Union is offering scholarships. There are eight scholarships available. The deadline to apply is March 31st. Go to this website for more information and applications. The Titan Auction and Social will be held on March 18th. Scan this QR code for ticket information. Please plan to attend and participate in the fun event that supports West Salem High School. Do you have a story to tell? Want to practice writing in a fun environment and join a supportive community of student writers? Come join Creative Writing Club on Wednesdays after school in room B225. All are welcome. Art Club is meeting on Wednesday mornings, 8.30 to 9.30, in room B203. If you would like to work on your art or projects for Wes, please join in the fun. The Digital Arts Club will be meeting on Wednesdays from 3.30 to 4.15 in B105. If you like to work on a project in photography, graphic design, animation, or videography, come join in. Maybe you've noticed how awesome these weekly video announcements have been. Maybe you've been thinking about becoming part of the team. Here is your chance. We're looking for members to create these amazing announcements for next year, but we need to get started this year. Look for this poster, scan the code, and let us know where you want to help out. Mr. Mayor will be in touch. Prom is coming up at the end of April. Here's some information from our prom committee member. Hi, my name is Lenny Herrera, and I'm junior class vice president. I'm Sophia Arnold, and I'm the junior class beer officer. And, and we're, we're here to update, update you guys about, about prom. prom. On April 6th, there will be a prom assembly. At this assembly, we will reveal the prom theme. Juniors and seniors, be sure to go because this is when the prom theme will be revealed. And West Salem Prom Committee is working with David's Bridal and Men's Warehouse. So definitely go to David's Bridal March 11th for the Diamond membership and you will get extra discounts. And same with Men's Warehouse to get those extra discounts for the West Salem students. Prom will still be on April 29th from 7 to 10 p.m. But there will still be more updates to come. So please stay tuned. Thank, Thank you. you. Voting for Prom Court has begun. Look for these posters around the school and scan the QR code. Be sure to vote for this year's Prom Court members. All students can vote. The pet of the week is Shelby's cat, Eisen. Send your pets to West Salem High School announcements on Instagram. On to sports. Spring sports season has begun. Baseball, softball, track and field, tennis, and golf open on February 13th, 2023. If you're interested in participating in a spring sport, make sure to fill out all forms and contact the coach to learn about practices and tryouts. Congratulations to Reese Lawson winning state wrestling, West's first state wrestling champ. Be sure to come support our CBC champion boys and girls basketball teams as they compete in OSAA postseason playoffs. Here are players to watch as the playoffs continue. As we transition into the spring sports season, we want to take a moment to remember athletes who have been recognized and honored so far this year. Be sure to check the community newsletter for information on school events. If you have any information or suggestion for these announcements, message us on Instagram or email Mr. Mayor. Don't forget, last Monday was President's Day, so that there was no school. And remember, it's a great, great day to be a Titan. Titan. I'm Morgan. And I'm Morgan. Here's what's up. For this week. I don't Something, 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 just, something. Just, uh, just go. Okay. I guess. Thanks, Henry.